y'all. So I figured when I'm having a bad day, one thing I always did is I always went and got a Starbucks. Somehow it just would make my day better. So I did a video for TikTok. I'm gonna do this one for YouTube. I have been in pain since Thursday of last week. Uh, jaw pain and it radiates from here up to there and then it radiates back down to here so I literally thought I have TMJ issue something going on um, I got COVID in January and jaw pain was one of my actually first symptoms so I took some ibuprofen and it did help and then it just got to where I was like, I couldn't pinpoint the pain. Like, was it here? Was it there? Was it here? And it just was weird to me. And it felt like it was getting worse. So, um, I put it off for as long as I could. And I called the dentist today and told her what all was going on. Told her that it feels better when I lay on a heating pad. And she said it sounds like implant infection which as you know is is like the worst case scenario in anybody's dental history going to the dentist and hearing implant infection so I'm on a good old 10 day supply of amoxicillin I meet with a implant dentist down here in E-Town um, on Wednesday to check 100% because she wasn't able to do an x-ray on me all her equipment's down right now because she's in the process of moving offices so it's not a for sure implant infection but she's pretty sure that's what it is um, but I will know Wednesday when I go meet with this implant dentist and I'm not sure what the thing is um, I've worked for an implant dentist and I kind of know what we're looking at but then I also know that people can have an infection they can be on antibiotics they can get it cleaned and they can keep it hopefully that's my case um but if not then i guess you guys are going to be on a journey with me once again at losing my implant and not wearing anything on the bottom and then getting an implant again um it's gonna be a journey of hell ain't it so i figure i'd just sit here and chit chat with you guys and eat while well, I still can because you know once you get your teeth removed it's soup city but it makes no sense like it doesn't hurt to eat it doesn't hurt to bite down it doesn't hurt to touch it but you know it's my luck I don't have any damn teeth and here I am with the damn infection I have the worst luck, I swear. When it comes to health or anything, it's one of the big reasons I've never really wanted to get any altercations done to me. Whether it be tummy tuck, boob job, whatever. Because God, my body would friggin' reject it. So that's how my day is going. I hope yours is going better. So I'm going to sit here, enjoy eating my food while I still got my teeth. And I will talk to you guys later.